What's happening, gentlemen and ladies and everything in between? I'm back here with bringing you some Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, recently I've been playing a lot more Modern Warfare 2 than usual, and surprisingly, I'm actually very surprised by this. I haven't been getting frustrated at all recently. But that's annoying that my um, class is a P90 Red Dot, G18 Red Dot, Marathon Stopping Power, and Ninja all Pro, of course, because that's just the way I roll. And using Tutor Beach Sound Hacks, I can get a kill and then get myself mowed down by the all powerful. That make no sense. Yeah, recently I've been playing a lot more Modern Warfare 2 because, I don't know, that's all my friends seem to play nowadays. And surprisingly, I haven't been getting as frustrated as recently. I used to always get commandoed and danger closed and just. <sighs> Excuse me, sorry. And like this right here. Look, stuck in the asshole takes my kill. That's perfect. But anyway, um, I have been playing a lot more Modern Warfare 2 recently. I've been getting. You know, commandoed as much, danger closed as much, random BS. I think that's because I've been staying away from ground war. I th I feel ground war is where most of the BS actually does happen. And before all I would play was ground war, I guess that's how I was getting so frustrated. And most people now all they play is ground war. But if you stay away from um, ground war, and you mostly play normal TDM or mercenary TDM. Or me and my friend, we actually went to a private chat and played TDM Express, which is what we're playing right here. Uh, so we don't have to talk to people in the lobby, because we're loners. And it's actually quite fun. Um, not many people use all the cheap MLC stuff, Danger Close, One Man Army, anything explosives. Um, random BS doesn't usually happen. And this game, and this is probably a unique gameplay just because it is a submachine gun. And I'm just going to say this right now: um, Invasion's a horrible map for an AC-130. I think I get like five kills with it. So I was really proud of this game just because I go 30 and two. Did a spoilers, uh, um, but anyway, and. Most of my kills were by my gun. I think my area only got me like. Mm, I want to say like three kills. And my AC-130 got me like five. So I got 25 kills from just my gun. So I was really. Oh, my Predator got me some. That's right. Predator can't forget that. So I got like over 20 kills for myself and air support on me a little. So I was really proud of that. I actually have this one game saved up with the Hamas, 31 and 1. No, I wouldn't go 31 and 1, my bad. It was 31 and 3. Um, I could have got a nuke, but I didn't have an enabled. And I kid you not, aside from the, um, I, from kills from air support, I think I got like, only like 10 kill, only like 10 kills with my gun. And that just proves how powerful air support really is. Now it should be. But, um, I want to get y'all a vote. I have this War to War 10 in 1 Search and Destroy game saved up. Would you like me to post that? And I have a Call of Duty 4 using the G3 going like 25 and 2. Would you like me to post that up? Or would you like me to upload a Modern Warfare 2 game going 31 and 3 with the. and showing how powerful air support really is? With the FAMAS. But yeah. Um, there really, really ain't much enough to talk about. Except. Hold on. Um, I've been recently watching Pawn Stars a lot more recently than I usually do. If you all don't watch that show very much, I suggest you do. It's, in my opinion, it's a really great show. And I love the show, and I laugh a few times from the old man. You just gotta love the old man. He's pro. Uh, and I'm probably gonna watch some of it after this. After I do th get done this commentary, I'll probably watch some after this. Yeah. Um. I want to get y'all's opinion. 
between all three of the Call of Duties, which one do you find um, the most satisfying to play? Personally, for me, it's World at War, and then it'd probably be Call of Duty 4, and then it'd probably be this game, there I may say. Um, I want to get y'all's opinion on that, just because this game really is frustrating, but then it, Call of World at War is probably the, the least frustrating just because the only thing frustrating about it is that bad spawn system and mp40 abuse but yeah that's it um using mp90 red dot final score was 30 and 2 15 to 1 kd p soup